All right, we have Mr. Corbin Tonelli. He is our Pro Start instructor. He teaches all the cool stuff about the food, and he came over to our shop. We have a brick oven pizza there, oven installed. And uh, it was, uh, I don't know, probably three or four years ago, and um, masonry class needed a place to put one, so they were building the walls for our classroom area here and uh, the saw shop and stuff like that. So they built it over in the corner, and uh, the oven is just really cool. We fired up maybe two, two, three times a year, and, uh, and then he started. Mr. Tenley started coming over and doing it, and uh, he he has all the science behind it, so it's even even nicer. And uh, but anyway, kind of showing just how hot this oven gets right there. You can see it's uh, it ends up getting exceeding 700 some degrees, and then it just got too hot for it to even read anymore so it uh pretty interesting how uh, how hot that thing gets and you can see right there the pizza itself neighborhood of 400 350 400 degrees and it just that's the key apparently to really good pizza is cooking it quick and hot and and it'll cook a pizza in a right at a minute and a half put in about 45 seconds spin it around another 45 seconds and jerk it out and eat it of course mo most foods apparently the the slower you cook them and the lower heat, the better they are, but not pizza. And um, anyway, he's uh, he's got it all down to a science, and it, uh, he does a really good job with it, and he gets the kids involved. You don't see the kids here. Um, they were, uh, this was, I think, at lunchtime, and so we didn't have any at that time, and he's making up a bunch for staff members right now, and I uh, didn't want to film with the kids in there, so, uh, but I kind of caught a little bit of it here. They were, they were knocking them out, and uh, they, kids, they, they learned a lot, and he, he does a really good job with them. The wide, he does some pretty complicated things with them too. But you can kind of see that uh, sprinkled stuff on that aluminum plate, and that is for the uh, lubrication to get it back off of there. If you just put the dough right on that metal, it sticks really bad. And uh, he's using a, a cornmeal, and uh, I forget the stuff that we used. Um, if I think of later, I'll throw it in there. We use some stuff that we it's pretty hard to get a hold of, and you put it down under it, and it worked pretty good too. So. Uh, Somebody out there probably knows what it's called. I can't think of it right now. But anyway, there he is. He gets the sauce on there, and they make the, the sauce from scratch. And they uh, um, they they do in the dough, of course, they made it from scratch. And they, they just do a really good job. So, uh, again, I'm going to let you check out some of these different things here and uh, uh, watching him build a couple of them here. But um, you can kind of see I, I didn't get to show some, some of the – stuff up in the top there but the classroom here in case somebody's wondering what it's built out of we sawed poplar i think we sawed these in 13 or 14 and and all of the uh the roof structure or floor structure for the upper level is 12 by 12 poplar and it's setting on 16 by 16 poplar uh kind of beams and then there's 12 by 12 posts there's one you can kind of see the corner of that post right beside him there under his arm there's there's the post that's in the middle of the room and uh, they all kind of rest you know on the walls and on those that post and we have posts around the outside too that they rest on but uh i had some people asking about that in a, a visit to fellow and he was asking about it. you kind of see right there at the top that's a 12 by 12 and there's a steel sign that the kids made and that's a 16 by 16 right there on top of 12 by 12 so but anyway through the window you can see the sawmill and the edger and some projects we were working on back there again this was shot in the spring of 20 it's the uh, uh apparel and um but anyway it's uh it's just a lot of fun we try to get the kids involved in stuff and and they really have a good time everybody will bring something and we'll have a good good fun uh, uh day and we, we do like a christmas pick uh christmas um time that we do it and then also we'll do and we call it a spring picnic and if there's some other special event we'll do another one in the, throughout the year but that's our primary times and it's, it is really good stuff and uh, of course i'm i, I like poop food and i like pizza and it, it's hard to make a pizza bad for me but uh I, I really really like that pizza it is it is that's the only brick oven pizza i've ever tried and man it is it is really good Sorry about that bell ringing in there and then a little message come over the intercom. But anyway, I'll uh, be quiet and let you listen to some of this sizzle. And uh, thanks for watching.